A store in Redmond was broken into Tuesday morning and several items were taken. Carly Keenan joins us now with the details. Carly? Yeah, Lee, I spoke with the owner of the store and he believes this was a planned incident. Based off what was taken, he thinks the person had been in the store before. Art and music in downtown Redmond is a family owned business with a mission to inspire and teach creativity. You can buy art supplies, instruments, sign up for a painting class, or take guitar lessons. Terry Hurt, the owner, says the store has been open for about two and a half years and was shocked when the store was burglarized. Hurt got an alert sound around 1.30 a.m. Tuesday morning that the alarm system was going off. When he got there, the front door was shattered along with the door to the music room. We walked in, what we noticed is the guitar that was right here was pushed sideways like this. This guitar was pushed sideways like that so they could get to that guitar and just come through and grab that particular guitar. Not just any guitar was taken. It's a 1960 double cutaway um, Gibson Les Paul custom special, big name. It just, it's just a fantastic guitar. It's older, um, beautiful shape, almost perfect condition. There probably is one of those in Redmond, Oregon or in the surrounding areas and that was it. It's a very unique, very special guitar. Hurt says two other guitars and a saxophone were also missing. What was going through your mind when you got that call at, what is it, 1.30 a.m. and you uh, show up here and see your store like this? Yeah, it was, uh, you know, it's a little heartbreaking, I think, you know, um, to see glass smashed everywhere. Redmond police are still investigating. Hurt says from the security camera footage, the whole ordeal only took 18 seconds. But in that 18 seconds, $4,000 worth of instruments taken and two glass doors shattered. We love what we do. Um, we have, in, you know, inspire in our windows, you know, and that's, that's our goal is to inspire people with music and art. And so uh, having one, you know, bad guy is like, it's a blip. It's like whatever, just move on. You fix the door, fix the other door, and you just move on and just appreciate the outreach and the love that we get from our community, you know, that we stand together. Terry Hurt and his family are raising money to help cover some of the damages. If you want to donate, we'll have the link to their link tree in the web version of this story at ktvz.com. Lee?